everybody, my name's Rosie and welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel. How are you all? I hope you're all doing really, really well. So, my mum, bit of backstory, literally like, not Christmas gone, the Christmas before, got me a Boohoo voucher and at the time I was working with Boohoo a bit before they ghosted me and um, I hadn't spent it and then at the beginning of the year I was trying to spend it and it wouldn't work and I've been going back and forth for literally months with Boohoo to try and get this voucher to work and in the end they told me you can't spend vouchers on their website uh sorry on their app and it has to be on their main website so I finally managed to spend the voucher it was going to be running out of Christmas and I felt a little bit like because I had like two year lifespan I kind of felt a little bit like they were trying to get that money from us you know but anyway I've managed to and I, what I've done is I've bought loads of jeans so we're going to be trying on different jeans from Boohoo today pretty similar styles because I am a 34 year old woman, so therefore all I own really is skinny jeans. I have one pair of mum jeans that I like, a couple of mum pairs of jeans that I don't like, but I've tried to make work. Now I don't know how the returns process works for things that you bought on a voucher, but we'll find out if I have to send any back. So yeah, we've got lots of jeans here and I've got two standard t-shirts as well. Anyway, if you are new here, I do have two little pugs. You will hear snoring and grunting through every single video of mine. I know a lot of you like the sound of the pugs in the background. If you don't like dog snoring, then just click off because it's not for you here. Um, but yeah, I'm a size 16 to 18. I got some of these jeans in a 20. Um, they're all from a plus size range. I'm 5 foot 8. <sighs> Let's see what's crack a and I'll leave all information on the screen. You know how we do, and yeah, let's go. And what I've actually done is I've put on a black body under this because I just thought it'd be easier. You'll be able to see them properly. Doesn't hold me in. Just a primer one, just smooth everything out. Okay. Got a good old range of jeans there. The first off, we'll start with a pair of mum jeans, size 18. Okay, they. I don't know if they're gonna fit me. They might fit me. This is one thing I was worried. Like with stretch skinnies, it's fine because I know that they're stretch that material. But with mum jeans and there's no stretch, I'm like, do I get an 18? Do I get a 20? I'm not a size 20, but if the jeans aren't stretching, then maybe I am a size 20. <laughs> anyway, let's try and see. Okay, guys, because we're doing trousers, I've just moved the camera down a bit. These aren't as bad as I thought they might be. They do up. And I've got some room, actually, at the back. I've got quite a bit of room here. I always find that weird. Um, but I don't mind them. The only thing is they are that little bit too short in the leg, standard. I mean, I'm five foot eight. I'm not like the tallest person in the world. But I've just folded them up on this leg and I actually don't think it looks too bad as a crop pair of jeans. I don't have any in this colour, especially not mum jeans. And they're surprisingly really comfortable. The pockets on the bum are in quite a nice place, I think. Um, they're really nice and high-waisted. The button was a bit stiff to get done up, but once I was in, I was in. And then the pockets at the front are really deep, so that's quite nice. What do we think of pair one? I don't hate them. I think they were pretty cheap, um, so I think I would wear them. I quite like the denim of the denim. I quite like the denim as well. Um, so yeah, I don't hate them. Nice and cash. Pair of trainers. Let me know what you think. Next up, we've got plus high-waisted mum jeans, light blue and a size 20. These ones are going to look like they're going to be quite baggy. And I don't think the length's going to be... Oh, they're folded up a bit. Let's try and see. Okay, I'm going to say that these are just a bit too big. Um, so, turns out maybe on Boohoo, I am an 18 in mum jeans. Well, we'll see. I bet every single pair is different, honestly. But yeah, these are just that little bit big. They're fine if you want that sort of oversized baggy you know, jean look, but they are very roomy, um, all round, really. They just look a little bit clown panty. Um, so yeah, probably a no. I quite like the light blue, and it's a really nice soft denim, like not too lightweight, still no stretch. Um, nice pockets again at the front, and then what are the pockets on the bum saying? They're all right, I'd want them to be higher, so like the higher the pocket and the further in makes your bum look better and these pockets are quite low and because they're light denim you can really see that. I feel like 
and I don't usually say things like this on my channel, but I feel like if I was teensy minty tiny and I had a pair of oversized jeans like this and I belted them in, it actually could look quite cute. Not that that couldn't look cute on a plus size person because it absolutely could. I just feel like, not for me, especially where they are sitting at the ankle, I think where they are a bit ankle swingery, it's making it look even worse. Um, I'll pan you down so you can see the ankle properly. So they aren't overly ankle swingery, but they're a bit, look, you can see, like, this isn't a good, this isn't a good look, is it? Um, they are rolled up at the ankle, which is nice, so you could lengthen them down to make the length better on the leg. But it's quite nice rolled up, isn't it? These ones are a no-go because they don't fit me. Okay, so these are the plus all over ripped mum jeans, acid wash in a size 20 again. So it'd be interesting to see the size comparison of these ones. Okay, we've got the same problem as the last size 20. So there's a bit of consistency there, which makes a nice change. But yeah, these are just too big again. They feel right on the legs because they are like a slim mum jean. But here and around here, it's just too big. I like the distressed look. Um, I actually feel like, and I've got quite slim legs, but I actually feel like if I got these in an 18, but they might be more like skinny jeans on the legs for me, but with no stretch, because there's not the most amount of room there to make them look overly baggy. But yeah, I like the distressedness. I like how sort of worn they look. Nice and high-waisted again, but just a bit too big pockets again on the front i don't love the pockets on the bum again they're just not the right placement i don't think but i do like this v detail that's on the back um yeah these ones are another no because they don't fit but i would be intrigued to try them in an 18 to see the comparison and see what they'd be like on the legs so number three are also going back okay so the next pair we have is another pair of ripped ones but these are straight legs plus plus acid wash ripped straight jeans in an 18. Okay, yes, these jeans I think I really like. Okay, let's move it down so you can see properly. Okay, shall we? Yes. So these are the straight leg. And yeah, I really like the fit. I really like how they look. I like the light blue. I like that it has this little bit of distressness, but not overly. And also on this side at the knee, it's got a tiny little bit of distressness. Uh, they are lovely and high-waisted and they fit me really well again i've never really struggled with this but i'm struggling with this it's not the end of the world but <laughs> i'm struggling with that um yeah the length's really nice as well they hit my foot and they are rolled up slightly that rolled upness is stitched like that but i actually think the length's okay i could probably done with them being a tinch bit longer i'm curious of how they would sit over over trainers just grabbed a random trainer that was in here i don't have a little mirror in here so i'm trying to gauge i think they're all right yeah they are covering the trainer they're not fighting with it so i think they're okay the pockets on the bum are quite small i could have done with them being slightly up but they're okay and i think they'd make my bum look all right um yeah i just think they're a cute a cute little pair of jeans. What do we think? I think you could dress them up or dress them down. I So far, number four's my fave. If you wanna join in in the comments, just number one to however many we've got, thumbs up, thumbs down. Let me know what you think, I'd love to know. Um, but yeah, I think I'll keep these. They're comfy, I feel like I could eat in them, I feel like I'm moving them. I'm going bowling tonight, so maybe you could do a bit of bowling, bowling, yeah, yeah exhausted after that you're gonna be like rosie why have you just bought all the same pairs of jeans <laughs> these are plus high-waisted mum jeans acid wash again light blue in an 18 they're similar but all different and i just didn't know i didn't know what was or wasn't gonna work okay to me these aren't really a mum jean these feel really strange so they're like tight like a skinny jean loose at the waist which is weird baggy at the back again but they are like skin tight but no movement also on this calf Either one leg's sewn tighter than the other, or I've got one calf bigger than the other, probably the latter. It feels really tight on this calf. It's a shame because I do like a slim fit mum jean, but these are not the slim fit mum jean for me. I mean, compared to my around this area, I've got quite slim legs, especially my calves. They're not slim for everybody, but for my 
you know, shape and what I've got working. A lot of my lardy bit sits around my tummy, my hips, my upper arm, but not my not my legs or my lower arm, especially my lower legs. Top of my legs are a bit more chunky, but not my calves. Never normally struggle with calves. But this calf on this side, my right hand side, feels weird. Um, yeah, I don't, I just feel like I wanna pull it down. But I can't, I can't bend down. I wouldn't be able to sit and eat in these. Very restricting in certain areas. These are a no. But if I'd sized up in these, they wouldn't have looked right, would they? And they would have been too big around here but on the legs, and I think maybe that's what the distress pair in the size 20 that I tried on would have been like as well, you know. I feel like they would have been too tight in the leg. Yeah, it's weird. But these ones are a no. This is why I've got different sizes, see, and different styles. We're all different. There'll be some people out there, these will fit perfectly, look amazing. And the other ones that I liked will not. But yeah, it is a shame because I don't think they look overly bad. So what's that, number five? Thumbs up or thumbs down, it's a thumbs down for me, I think, on these ones. Okay, guys, we're on the last pair of jeans now, and then I've got two t-shirts that I will quickly show you. These are plus high-waisted mum jeans, size 20. So do we think they'll be too big, like the other two 20s? Now, I actually remember the reason I got these in a 20 is because they were sold out on the 18, and I think they were a tenner. So I just wanted to try, but yeah, they're too big. Yeah, these are too big. Turns out I'm a size 18 in Boohoo jeans, okay? So we know now, lessons learned. But yeah, these are very, these are bigger than the other two 20s. Um, the denim's okay. I prefer the first pair of like the darker blue jeans that I tried on. These were like a tenner, I think. All information will be on the screen and I'll link whatever I can that's still in stock down below. Um, the length of these is quite nice. Can you guys see the length? <sighs> yeah, the length's quite nice. Maybe they wouldn't be though if it was in a size 18. Yeah, they're nice soft material, but I've got nothing loads to say because they don't fit me. And I'm just not excited by them. Um, so yeah, that's that. We're gonna go for jeans, number six, a thumbs down from me. Six pairs of jeans I'm keeping too. Let's try the t-shirts on. Okay, if we know anything about me, let's move York. It's like I bloody love a good t-shirt, don't I, girls? I bloody love a good t-shirt. And there's some cute little ones. These were in the sale, definitely from the plus section again do you know what when i film when i start filming i'm fine and then when i'm mid filming all of a sudden i get this wave of being really hungry all of a sudden i'm really hungry got this little t-shirt thought it was pretty cute what do we think they're just t-shirts hands we'll try one really quickly but you know a t-shirt's a t-shirt i got these up in a size i think so this is 20, and it's meant to be oversized. That's one thing I noticed about Boohoo. They say their t-shirts are oversized. I go up a size, and that's, to me, what an oversized t-shirt is. So like, I still have to go up a size to get it the type of oversized that I like. Does that make sense? And even still, I'm not, I wouldn't say that's overly oversized. To me, it's just a bit of a standard t-shirt. I would have been happy if this two sizes bigger. Yeah, it's not bad. It's okay. I'll definitely wear it. Um, I like the little slogan on it. They had loads of these kinds of t-shirts, guys. All different ones, loads of them. And they were in the sale, like I said. I like to knock them up, honestly. Um, but I also wear them casually around the house as well, especially with cycling sort shorts when it's warm. And yeah, I just lounge around in, in baggy t-shirts, you know. This t-shirt I loved. Oh, the print feels horrible. Um, I got it in a size 20 again. This is an oversized t-shirt again. See, that one looks more oversized. But I still probably would have been happier with it one up. But look, it says, just peachy on it. I thought that was so cute. I swear the older Peggy gets, the louder her snoring gets. Little pig. Okay. Yeah, this is cute. This is the type of oversized that I like. Because it is actually oversized, you know? That is so cute. Again, I would knot it up. But I just love the just peachy on there make probably make people want to look at my bum as they walk past me they want to do a little glance around just to make sure i'm not lying and they'll see that i'm not lying and, you know it'd just be fun but yeah i'd wear it knotted up like this that's cute huh i think that's quite cute i like it i love a good t-shirt but anyway guys we're mainly here to talk about the jeans so as i said before i ordered six pairs of well five pairs of mum one pair of straight is that right and i'm keeping two and the two that i'm keeping 
are the first, very first pair that we tried on, the darker blue mum jean, because I do think I'll get some use out of these, just casually. I find they're a little bit short in the leg for me, um, but I think I can make it work, because I just have them rolled up and a little bit, you know, cropped. And then I'm going to keep these straight leg jeans. So, I now know, in this style jean, like straight leg mum jean, I'm a size 18 from Boohoo. There's my light. There's been no inconsistencies there in regards to that size and bracket. Let me know what you think. Let me know of anywhere I can get jeans from. I love new look jeans, but recently, oh, I really love new look jeans, but recently they just haven't had any that are um, floating my boot. And all my jeans are skinny jeans. And then when I go out and about, I feel like, yeah, middle-aged woman that's not keeping up with the fashion. And I'll forever love a skinny jean, especially with heels on a night out. But I do feel like I want to keep following the times. But it's much more difficult, I think, to find a mum jean slash baggy legged jean, whether that be balloon, boyfriend, straight leg, whatever. It's a lot harder to find that than a, a skinny jean, especially if you have got the curves. So, yeah. Let me know what your thoughts are. Let me know if there's anywhere good jeans. I do keep an eye out. I don't want to spend loads. In fact, I don't want to spend anything if I can avoid it. I was hoping more of these would be all right. But I'm going to send these back. Hopefully, I'm assuming they'll just reimburse me onto another, like, oh, you can swap it. I don't know. Maybe I'll try some of their other jeans. It'd be good to bolt by jeans that I don't actually have to pay for, you know? But anyway, I'm going to stop waffling on. Let me know your thoughts, guys. I am starting to do TikToks. I have done a TikTok of this as we've been going along and some other ones and I want to get better over there so please do go and check it out if you do have TikTok obviously Instagram as well everything will be linked down below thanks so much for hanging out with me and I look forward to the next one thanks so much guys bye